ইউজ and what is the need to use uh, the react js in your application and what will be the benefit uh, with uh, as you know that we all uh, discuss uh, any technology with respect to practical okay uh, we will cover both uh, as well as theory and uh, practical too so let's just begin first of all uh, for the introduction purpose you just need to know about uh, react that uh, what is react Okay, when you google it you will find that it is nothing it's not a new technology i mean it's not uh, nothing very new it is just an updated version of javascript and uh, you cannot say that it is uh, the new framework of javascript it is library using for building ui and uh, and uh, many more benefits are there than we can do uh what we can maintain state the main benefit that i realize by using react js is that we can uh, maintain the state of any page any component okay many more uh, advantages are there that i realize by learning it and practicing it that uh, in normal traditional application we have a uh, page suppose if i okay first of all i la let you to the official document of react js okay this is the official document where they told tell us that it's nothing it's just a javascript library for building user interface okay as i told but uh, okay many more benefits are there that if you take this uh, website if i ask you to make this website you will make this website and uh, you will uh, design a complete page and you will uh, use all that dynamic approaches on this page that is showing on this page but in react uh, we do something different we make uh, we actually break the page into components like you you are seeing this uh, navigation bar we make it uh, separate we make this uh, you know jumbo print if uh, separately we'll make a different component for this reading item okay and as you can see there there is a repetitive code we are doing the repetition div 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 and in that div we are repeating the heading 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 and we are repeating the paragraph 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 so there is a three div for displaying this uh, but in react we do what you just make one div and uh, make a component of that uh, any thing and you just re reuse it so the main benefit is to reuse the component okay if you are not getting this and you are new to this then don't worry we'll discuss it with the practical approach okay for right now you just have to download the node js for the uh, in development of uh, react js for using react js you must have node js on your pc so just go to the node js download and go to the official website this is nodejs.org then click on this and uh, uh, as i'm using windows so you have to click on this windows folder uh, a set of file will be downloaded to your uh, download folder as i already have downloaded so i'm not going to download it again okay here it is i guess i uh, okay i downloaded it the latest version is this right now and might be in the future they will update it. okay okay for checking that uh, you might have node on your pc for checking purpose we'll go to the cmd and we'll write uh, this command okay for well, what we have to write we'll write npm minus minus v okay as you can see that uh, npm is not recognized as an ex internal external command uh, okay so that means i do not have uh, node installed you can write node minus v okay that means node.js is not installed right now on my pc so i have to make it install right now so just go to the setup and click it 
not a very difficult to install this you just have to click next 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 and work will be done easily okay it will take a few minutes to install okay okay for the visual uh, code as a code editor uh, we have so many options but uh, i recommend you personally for the visual code so just go to the website and you can download uh, visual code from download visual code and this is the option for the window as i already have downloaded visual code so i will not download it you may download it from this code.visualstudio.com setup okay and there will be a download button here it is when you click it a uh, setup file a setup file will be downloaded Okay, fine. As you can see that my setup file has been downloaded, so I just have to click on the finish button. Okay, and the remaining thing is that you have to download it from uh, the Visual Studio Code, and this is the button that you have to uh, click on this, and uh, your work will be done after clicking this. Okay, so the next thing is, okay, I have to check that my Node.js installs successfully or not. Now come back to the CMD for checking that. We as we have successfully uh, installed or not npm minus minus v. Okay, fine. Correct. We have installed node and the uh, npm version is six point thirteen four. And write node minus v to check. Okay, version of node is twelve point sixteen point one right now. So we have successfully installed the nodes on our system. So make it uh, done if you have no, uh, not any version of Node, and I recommend you to use the latest version. If you have previous version, you can uninstall it and then install the latest version because uh, there would be some conflict uh, in the code if you uh, use some very old version. Okay, and the next thing you have to make sure that you must have uh, Visual Studio Code. Uh, okay, when you download it, open it. And you will get a, a first visual uh, appearance like this that I'm opening for you. Okay, if you are new to this, I don't think so that any developer would be new for this. If uh, don't worry, if you are new to this, I will guide you from the scratch. My videos are for the beginners uh, and for anyone. Okay, that's all for this video. We'll discuss it. We'll create our next. Uh, we'll create our first app, React app. In our next video, thank you for watching and please, please do like and share and subscribe to my channel. Thank you, Allah Fils.